In this short video, I'm going to be showing you how to use ChatGPT in the Icelandic language. Now, whether you want to translate the front page of ChatGPT or whether you want to actually have a full-on conversation with ChatGPT in the Icelandic language, in the next two minutes, I'm going to be showing you everything you need to know in order to make that happen. Now, as you can see on the left-hand side here, there isn't actually a settings button, which means that ChatGPT is currently only officially available in English. Um, however, I did find a way around that. Now, I am using Google Chrome on the Windows PC, so if you're using a mobile phone, a different browser or operating system, the problem Process might be a little bit different for you um, so whatever the case may be at the very least please make sure you're using Google Chrome because I'm not sure whether the feature that I'm going to show you in just a second is available on any other browser so once you're on Google Chrome on ChatGPT simply right click anywhere on the screen then click on translate to in my case it's English so to add Icelandic to this list of languages click on the three dots then click on choose another language then click on the little arrow here and find Icelandic from this massive list of languages it's right there click on translate and as quickly and as easily as that, the front page of ChatGPT is now translated to the Icelandic language. So, when it comes to actually talk with ChatGPT in Icelandic, um, all you have to do is simply talk with ChatGPT in that language and it's going to revert back to you in the same language. So, just to test this out, I've actually gone ahead and copied a little phrase from Google Translate and let's see what ChatGPT comes back with. Now, if it does give you an error like it did in my case, or if it takes a little too long uh, to give you a response, all you have to do to fix that is simply uh, refresh the page and try it again. And within a few seconds, as you can see already, ChatGPT is going back to me with a response in the Icelandic language. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.